what's up guys it's your boy truth EF, back with another banger video and uh today is going to be on a full guide through slash tutorial of pez 2020 my club and uh just you guys can tell me in the comments like anything to be honest anything uh about you know this it could be anything like coronavirus you know whatever i'll respond to anybody because not many people comment down in the comments below so i mean it's not like i'm gonna lie on you guys either so uh, today we're going to be focusing on my club only and you can also tell me if you want me to focus on other parts of the game Like it could be anything in kickoff Which is all this anything in eFootball Anything in statistics anything in settings uh, become a legend or master league anything. Uh, I know this game like the back of my hand so We're uh, hopping in my club right now And I'm gonna give you guys a brief introduction of what my club basically has to offer and I'm going to go ahead and let this load. <clears throat> and hopefully it loads fast. So here we go. Come on, load. Come on, load. All right, here we go. So starting from match, right? What's on is basically either you can go and uh, you can go against bots, which is versus comm challenges, or go against uh, online actual people. And the online actual people... Uh, challenges have better rewards and the bot challenges have uh, worse rewards so uh, whatever you guys like to do if you want to you know go against bots play against bots right here want to go against online go against online uh, so that's what that has to offer for a ranked match is basically it's very self-explanatory if you want to be ranked in Pez so if you want to have a good rate uh, rating or ranked uh, you basically hop in a ranked match versus you and another player online Who's looking to get a better rating too? My club co-op is basically you and either I think it might be your friend or randoms that you can go against, and they would play with you, and they would have the same team as you, and they can switch to the same players than you and everything. the The ranked match uh, simulator, which sim is uh, short for simulator, and uh, this is basically what this you're basically the manager. Here on this you're basically the manager and you would fix anything like the substitutions to how high you want your defense to be to if your players are tired and you know whatever you know you would switch anything like that and you would just like have them and you're not playing you're not playing specifically you in this you're just watching it's kind of like you're watching a football game or a soccer game in uh, your house or from a TV and uh, versus calm is basically very also very self-explanatory it's uh, a bot opponent they can go against and uh, test how good you are and this is what i would use for pra practicing i'm um, sorry excuse me for practicing in pez if you're just starting out i would go against the bots uh my club friendly match is basically you and a couple of buddies if you want to invite them or all randoms and you can just play a non-ranked online who cares for a fun match. My club store is basically where you can buy all the in-game shit. Uh, inbox is, I'll get to that later actually. And my club records is basically more challenges that you can do. And I've done most of these, but more challenges you can do. And you just have to follow this. And, you know, after you're done with uh, your challenges, after you complete one, it'll be right here in your inbox waiting for you. And you should have a little red one on the right side of inbox and uh, again if i miss anything here make sure to tell me in the comments i will for sure uh thank you and uh like a comment and uh reply back all right now we're going on to squad management all right i'll get into squad management at the last thing because i think that's the most complicated so i'll come back to that so my club members is basically you can look at all the players you have so right now i have 29 players and my managers i have six managers Training is uh, basically where these... Okay, I'll get back to that too, actually. Okay, so my club records... Uh, oh, same thing, same thing, my bad. The contracts, right? Contracts on these agents are... Uh, you can basically buy players here, and I would, uh, I would buy them from these two, not the top agent, because the top agent is... You'll get the worst type of players and the worst type of rarities, and... Or the worst rarities of the good players. So if you want a good rarity of like let's just say 
um, Messi or Ronaldo. You would it would have like your team. So right now we have a a special uh, FC Barcelona team. Uh, we have a special of them going on right now, so you can get Andres Iniesta, you can get Xavi. Uh, you see those people up there, up there, up there. And uh, I, I don't know how to pronounce the last guy's name, but I know it starts with a P, Pyro, something like that. And uh, I am a fan of Barcelona. No hate, please. But anyways, um, yeah, so you can either pick from here and you would press it. it it's normally right here, 100, which is the another some more in-game currency, which is on the top right. You can see I only have 70. I spent some, I spent some money, you know. And uh, you would also get these. So if you, if you take a look at the profile, which we would do by pressing square, and I'm on PS4, by the way. You would see that we have a uh, we have 30 black balls, 90 gold balls, 180 silver balls, zero 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 copper and zero white. So silver balls are kind of in the middle of rarity. Gold balls are a little bit higher than silver, but also kind of bad. And what you're really gonna want to be looking for is black balls. Black balls are gonna be. I know that sounds actually gay as fuck, but black balls are actually gonna be what's gonna get you through pairs and what's gonna help you out a lot. So we, as you can see here, we can get. Griezmann, Messi, best friend in the fucking world, Messi of course. We got Busquets, uh, Ter Stegen, Tony Kroos, Gareth Bale, Rakitic, uh, Jordi Alba, Casemiro. All these people you can get basically. But if you're lucky, you can get them. So you you would be able to get like a gold ball and a silver ball most likely because there's more of them instead of the black balls. I hope that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. And um. We'll go back to scouts. Here at scouts, you'll be able to sign players. So basically, if you have any scouts, you'll get them from winning games. Right here, boom, I have one. I have a French league, so I'll go ahead and use that. Request negotiation. I'll press X. Request negotiation. Request negotiation. Boom. I'm waiting for the game to load. You, do, you can just skip this. I know I'm going to get somebody bad because of how good the scout is. And I got Passy, right? He's from France, of course. We got a French person. We got a French ball. So uh, we'll, go ahead and, we'll go ahead and take him anyways. He's been added to our club already, and I'll show you him in a little bit. So we just want him. Auction house is basically a waste of time. I wouldn't go here. I would not ever go here to buy because you're just overpricing players that you can just get for winning challenges and stuff. So it's just overpriced. The rest of this I'm not going to tell you guys about because this I never use. I would never use these. I think this is a waste of time, especially the South Scouts. It's a complete waste of money. Complete waste of money. I'll show you guys another easier way to get money if you guys are looking for that. All right, so now we're gonna go over here, squad. Now we're gonna go to the squad management. Now we're gonna go over here, and now, as you can see, my squad is all right. We got a 99 team spirit on the top right. As you can see that, top right, team strength is 300, three, say 300, my bad, 3,701. We got a five-star team. Our total cost is 664 out of 840, so I'll talk, I'll talk about that a little bit later on. My formation is a 4123. And if you guys want to keep on just reading all these things on the top right and the bottom right, you can just see what I have going on here. Contract duration is actually pretty important for you guys to look at, take a look at. And it'll tell you how long you have to keep these players and how long uh, these players are going to be uh, kept until you need to pay for their contract renewal. So we got uh, his, con his contract duration is 4, his is 9, 3, 6, 5, 7, 5, 8, 4, 1. And we got a 10 right here. Okay, so perfect. So one. So I'm going to play a game today. And uh, after my game, his contract duration is going to end, right? So it doesn't mean I'm going to necessarily lose him. But if I don't pay his new contract, I won't be able to play him. So it's always a good idea to have backups. So if I don't have enough money, if I uh, run out of money in this game, I'll have uh, Sergio Roberto in my uh, backup. So if I don't have enough money to pay his contract renewal, I'll have... Uh, backup Sergio Roberto 83 overall not the best but it is the best that I have right now uh, my manager right now is Southgate and he, he plays for England currently or he doesn't play for England I'm sorry he he manages in England and um, my familiar my uh, familiarity uh, I know I pronounced like, that word wrong so if you guys want to send me hate down in the comments again um, that basically means how familiar he is with the players so this is as familiar as he can get with the players and uh, that's a good thing because the players like him and that brings up the team spirit too so when the players like my my manager it'll bring up the team spirit and everything's you know it's happy day uh, candy and rainbows right and uh, the way to bring up the the familiarity 
is go to it says right here manager menu so which i'm gonna press square on that and i can get a i have three of those uh familiar uh familiar boosts and uh, basically if i press x i would be able to use it and it would be items used you can put i only have three so i can only use three i would press okay but i'm not gonna do that because that is a waste right now he's at max so and uh management skills boost perfect all right so the total cost when i said i was gonna get back to that this is what total cost means 664 out of 840 let's say you're just starting out pez right and you're gonna get so lucky from a pack or uh, so lucky and you're gonna get uh ronaldo or messi right you're not gonna be able to use them on your team or you might be able to use them on your team but it really depends on what manager you have so 664 out of 840 that's that's pretty good in my book because i can use all of these players without my team spirit going all the way down so basically if i go over my total cost so let's i, I can't really do that right now because my total cost is too good but do i have another okay here we go this should be good so right now i just switch my managers boom perfect all right so as you can see here, my my team is too strong for this manager. So my team spirit went all the way down and my team my team rating is still the same. You know, it's still a five star, uh, but don't think you can just use this manager and you know get away with it basically. No, you cannot, you can't. Because your team spirit, they'll be tired, they'll be they won't just they won't play as themselves. So Messi won't be scoring the bangers he would score and Coutinho won't be scoring the long shots he was scoring. Mbappe won't be juking out. Everybody, they'll just be slow, tired. They look like they're dumb. The passing will be terrible. Everything's t a bad day with bad managers and bad uh, management skills. So we're going to go back to my good manager, which is Southgate. Yes. And to do that, uh, I'll tell you guys right now. Press X right here. Go here and you can just press. You should have managers. And I'll show you the way to get managers right now. And we'll go to the game plan now. Game plan. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to speak through this guy, sorry, because I still have a game to play. But uh, we have Coutinho, all these people here. This is my game plan. My my setup is 4 2, three, four, two one, three. Uh, My preset tactics, you can't change these because of your manager. He likes these preset tactics, and you cannot change them. Same with defensive, you cannot change them. Kind of annoying. And my advanced tactics, all right? So I'm going to put anchoring. So uh, Odegaard uh, switches that. I'm going to have to switch up my, my, my players right now. Offense 2, I'm going to put false winger. So... That guy, so Mbappe goes up, or whoever I put there is going to go up. Deep defensive line, I think, is pretty good, because when we lose the ball, it'll go, they'll go back to defense. And we'll have a wing back. So we'll pass, be able to pass the ball when somebody is open, and he'll just be basically open, right? So now I have to switch players. So I'll put my that guy right there, put you down there. So I'll, put you, I'll switch you as DMF. So the way to do that is press square. On game plan right here, team, team sheet slash edit position, press square. And you can switch to what you want him as. So, of course, I'm going to pick the higher rarity. Mbappe, I'm going to switch him over to center forward. I'm going to put Messi over at right wing where he belongs. I'm moving my players like this while holding X. Moving him up, moving him up. And boom, we're back in my old formation. Boom, boom, boom. And you can use a D-pad even to get a little bit more accurate of uh, lineups of how you want your players to be. So, boom. And Pez is normally really good with telling you where your players can go and where they can't. So look right there. They can't go right there. If I leave them there, they'll go back to the spot. He can't go there. So we're going to put them right there as high as possible so we get some more extra coverage. And right now, I like this. I like Van Dyke right there. Um, I think, I'll, yeah, I like this right here. This is good. Player settings. We'll have the captain and Messi. Captain. Long free kick taker as the highest overall. Short free kick taker as Messi because, of course, Messi's a beast at free kicks. We'll have free kick taker number two. Uh, Mata because he's the other highest overall left corner tick is uh, corner kick is messy and he isn't the highest overall but he's the shortest so in order for me to get a good header from the players who aren't the shortest I'm gonna put Messi in as both of my left corner kick and my right corner kick because I've never seen Messi score a header of a goal and I, I know we've all seen that one video where Messi used his hand to score the uh, header so a uh, little, little cheap goal but I mean he had his moment for a little bit so now we're, done, now we're now that we're done with this, I'm gonna go ahead and teach you guys. Oh, before I do that, uh, these are my reserves. So if you look at reserves, these are all your backups. And oh, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this guy, right? So on my backups, right, I went to my reserves, and I press square on this guy, the guy I don't want in my team anymore, don't want him at all. 
Now, you can either convert him into an XP trainer, which is basically, it'll help out your one of your players. It'll help out one of your players level up, or you can just release him. If you need money, I, re I uh, insist on doing this. If you have a lot of these people, I this is an amazing way to get a lot of money real quick. And uh, so you would gain 250 GP if you proceed. Right here, boom. Release, boom. Now we have 250 more GP than we had. And uh, cool. Cool, cool. Oh, now our inbox. Here we go. My Cups coins. Oh. We got 300 My Cups coins. Amazing. Ma amazing, amazing, amazing. So I'm... Uh, this is the good thing about Pez too, because you don't always have to buy your shit, right? You don't always have to use money in this game, because normally this game just gives you a lot of good shit. So this is what I like about this game. And uh, I'm not going to send out anybody here because it's not worth it. You know, remember, it's a... Uh, I have a 20% chance of getting a good player. And I have a 70% chance. Oh, my bad. My bad. Oh, I'm, my math is bad. I have an 80% chance of getting a bad player. So I'm not trying to spend my money on a player I don't need. So so I'm going to come back over here. And I'm going to go ahead and show you how to get a manager now. So these are all pretty easy to do. I would never recommend loaning a player. And I wouldn't. And uh, the trade is kind of dumb because you have to have three of the same players, not just two. So that is kind of dumb. And I will go ahead and tell you how to get a manager. So click on the manager with X. And these are all the managers you can get. As you can see, I have some of the best managers. If you're just starting out Pez, you won't. You'll have some of the worst managers, which is kind of the dumb thing. But just grind on this game and you'll be able to get where I am. And basically, having the best manager isn't always a good thing because, you know, I have a... Uh, uh, what's his name? I have the guy from England, and he isn't the best manager, but he does have the best uh, familiarity. So I will, I will definitely take that over having a bad manager or a good manager with bad familiarity. So I'm gonna go ahead and hop in the game now, and we're gonna go against bots, and uh, we're just gonna play the game. And uh, you can either stay for the rest of the video or just leave, and uh, it depends on what you guys wanna do. And I'll go ahead and explain more of this. So the, the uniform I can switch since he's a bot I can switch his uniform so I'm putting that his put to he's gonna go to white and we're gonna have the famous Barcelona colors which is red and blue. Kickoff is when you want to start the game up. Game plan is when you wanna if you want to look at your game plan again and see what's up be like oh shit I don't want him here I want to actually switch him to AMF. Boom I can switch him to a better which is advanced middle forward which is I can switch him to a better overall which I'm not sure if it does anything but it just looks better you know it intimidates your opponents if you're going against online. And yeah, so if it does or something, make sure to let me know in the comments and uh, just, you know, uh, make sure to like the comment, reply and add it in uh, maybe another video. If I uh, do this again, right, if I do this again, go ahead and play it. The match settings and all those things, the settings is just basically where you can switch, you know, the settings you want to go ahead and play around with those, see what you like best, see what, you, what camera settings you like to go ahead and play around with them. Right now I have mine as dynamic wide, which you see is, I think is the best one in my opinion but you know if you guys want to go ahead and switch go ahead I'm nobody stopping you from doing that so I'm gonna go ahead and press options to skip this because I don't want to see all this so I go I went ahead and did that so if you guys want me to post the tutorial on tricks and how to play Pez basically and the, you know basically starter guide on how to play Pez and all this tricks and stuff I will for sure do that just let me know give me a and give me a, a comment down below and uh, we'll for and sure listen to your comment and warned. start doing that. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special <laughs> delivery from the rest. And now we're going to try to... Alright, awesome, awesome. Great early ball, which still can't be said for the finish. Look, there'll be no complaints at all with quick service like that. It's so difficult to all defend right. when the ball comes in so swiftly. And a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Wow. Okay. Mm. Oh, that's so cute, man. He's so cute. Alright, here we go, here we go. We're on the run on the right side. Come on. Little juke, little nice juke. Ah, oh, he got me. It's good, we still got it because we got Busquets, 93 overall in there. And a bad pass. Susan. 
Yes, I do. Yes, I know, man. Do every day. I just started making my team a little bit more compatible with this team. So let's see if this works. This little formation. Just play around with it. I don't know what I'm doing either. I'm just trying to make it a little bit better. So just play around with try to put your players in places you like and what you think is good. And uh, okay, but geez, they just have to have the ball this entire game. Luke de Jong. And he's shooting it? Shoot. Good shot, good shot. That was a good shot. I'll give him that. All right. So that that just comes with luck, all right? If you want to get that little uh, little rainbow ball, I, I don't know what it's called, but if you want to get that little rainbow ball, a little fake, you saw that little head fake? It works. We'll do a little juke. Boom. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Juking the bots never worked, to be honest. I wouldn't juke the bots. It's the stupidest thing. They need to fix that in the game. I know it's probably because like, they don't want to mess up. Okay. And the balls come out. It's because they don't want to make the bots too dumb, right? But uh, juking the box in this game just isn't worth it. Uh, it's a, a fake shot. Works a lot, it to be honest. Deadlocked. Fake shot's pretty good. I'll try doing that this game. Let's see if that works. To get it forward quickly. Ocampos. Yeah, how many fouls are we going to wait? Let me see this. My stats are right here, too. Let me see. How many fouls? I think I've given away like four already. God. 20 minutes in the damn game and we're going to give away four fouls. All right, that's one. That's what happened in 93 overall, Manuel Neuer does. The keeper really dug out his defense then. A magnificent effort. Oh, amazing ball. Alright. Mbappe is in the best so far range, so we might have to switch him out second half. I have a raspberry that I might want to put in. Not gonna lie. Mbappe is really fast though, really but I'm not sure speed really helps in this game. Come on, come on. That's just it. Oh, I should do a little sneaky thing, right. Oh, nice, nice. Oh, I should do it again. Alright, it still worked though. It's still good, still good. I know it works now. Learning, just learning. We got nowhere near the fucking goal. Lucas Ocampos. Trippier. Another foul. Wow. <clears throat> I can pick that all the way to the crib. Alright, let's see. Boom. Mbappe battles to win it back. Damn, bro, look at him. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Nicely measured pass. And here's the face to face with the keeper. Easy goal. He's gone for it. Goal, Barcelona. That, that sucks for the bot. He was doing so good all game. Let's see. There I think he, uh, I think he has more possession than me, too. Let's well, see. How's that for composure, Peter? You yeah, he's got way more possession than me. to put as much pressure on him by staying upright, but it didn't phase him, not in the slightest. Deadlock broken. It's 1 0. Well, that's the currency he deals in, and he's come good yet again. Never we're going to send him. We're going to send him. Boom. Easy send. Oh, chance. oh, which I've been a little sneaky, bro. I, I thought he was going to come towards me. Well. All right. Sometimes the he goalkeeper would rush, and uh, that's a really good move to do, which is a little, the little, what the? The little back. Take the ball back. Mbappe. Mbappe. Oh, yep. Sorry, Mbappe. I love you, but I don't. He's been racked with me. A chance that's created through very good grafting. Did well to get in the face of his opponent. All right, Juan, I'm going to need your opinion here, okay? Mm. What game is better, FIFA or PES? FIFA. FIFA, why? Oh, no, it's like a man. Just, like, just be honest. Like, what's better about FIFA? Uh, easy go. What's better about FIFA? I'm not, like, trying to. This is for like the viewers to see if they want to buy PES 20 or if they want to buy 
FIFA 20. I oh, don't know, I don't, I don't use the PC for that much. Mm. So, when I play FIFA, I think the gameplay is a lot smoother than PES. I just don't play PES or FIFA. I'm not a car player, dude. Well, I remember, I know you are, but I remember you played PES and FIFA a little bit. Especially with me. Uh, I think FIFA because the controls are in problem. Controls and... Yeah, yeah, I can see how people can be really good at FIFA. Especially with the controls. Controls are I think FIFA is a little slower too. Than like going all fast and PES. For real? I think FIFA is faster. Well, I think they're like the same rate, like, it's down by like 10 or 5 seconds, I guess. In, in Pez, let me check something out. I think you can switch out your, the, how fast they go anyways. Let me see this. I swear, there was like an option for that. There was an option for that. Height. Let's see this. Okay. I like this better. And it's Kutel. Just brushed off the ball there. Messi. Bruh. Okay, that's annoying. That should not have happened. Right through the middle. Now it's Ocamp. Shapes to shoot. Oh, hit the crossbar. Bro, this about to get so unlucky. Rashford. Out to the left it goes. Coutinho. God damn it. Our right, halftime. We're the winning by two goals. Your stats right here too. Boom. Are two up and everything is shaping nicely. Also, tell me if you want more commentary or if you want less commentary and when I'm playing the games. Uh, I know I'm not the best commentator, but you know, at least I try, right? Wanna get up? There you go, boom. Alright, even if you got up, it's fucking matter. Come on, bro. Get that. sends that a long way. Here's Lucas Ocampos. Oh, well intercepted. Wow, this... Really alert to the danger. Fuck. Alright, let's see. I'm, I'm actually going to start going to try right now. Vanega. Philippe Coutinho. Rashford. Hooks through there, flings in a up for the header. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. He needed. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out. I knew it. Yeah, that's what the boss like to do a lot too. Just pass it to the two defenders out there. And this worked their way up. It's kind of annoying. It's annoying because I want I like a uh, fast games. I don't want to just you know wait. That's kind of annoying, but still. Now the counter. Rashford, Rashford decides to play it back. Hit into the middle. Oh, it's not getting anywhere. Oh, good clear, Loki. Damn, what a pass! Forward, tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. I could send it back to my goalkeeper if I wanted to, but well, why would I do it when I have my four defenders there waiting for me? So. Easy go. Look at that. Oh, that was delayed, yes. the commentary. Wow. That was absolutely terrible commentary right there. lead is extended still further. Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. Yeah, I miss yeah. Peter Douglas. I really can't say enough as to how good the final ball was. You guys, they took the defense out. I love how he foul. made the game just ten times better with his voice. I mean, Jim Beglin's still good, but you know. Peter Doug is, in my opinion, he's always the best. Always gonna be the best. Commentator. Good challenge. He just stood firm. All right, so you see that guy right there? That's my anchoring. I don't know if I showed you my anchoring, but yeah, that is my anchoring. So anchoring is basically where my players. It's uh where I can pick. Oh, this is a good spot for them. So basically, anchoring is where I'm gonna move them. Again, another post shot. Especially this guy. So anchoring is basically going to keep my players to the, the sidelines. 
which is really helpful when I'm on the run or when I'm on the counter attack. Send him. Nice. Oh, he's open. Bro, we try going for the low, the low. Uh, the ball he goes down. I don't know what it's called. I mean, if you guys know what that ball's called, uh, send it in the comments, please. Come on, game. And it's played forward. Easy takeaway. Boom. Send him. He's got through. Fuck. Offside. He hit me. Referee rightly gives him offside. Really low elevator, huh? Vasquez. Oh. Mine. It's a loose ball. Skin is broken. Put in. Yeah, that does look a foul. If he's given a free kick. Bro, how many fouls? How many fouls? It's got to be like 30 fouls, right? <laughs> like seven, I'm guessing he's seven. In no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. 11 yeah, fouls. Yeah, he has to change his ways or this referee could soon change his status. Oh, I should have picked that thing. I was doing this. Good save. That's all the reflexes of the 93 overall goalkeeper. Boom. Last week, I gotta get a 93 overall goalkeeper. Alright, fuck it. We're gonna use that Shreshny now. Why not? Oh, what am I? Do I have him? I don't have Shreshny. Fuck. Alright, it's all good. Right here, we're gonna go to. Zonal. I normally wait for when he's about to kick it. So uh, they all rush in, and my players all rush in at the same time. So it's like a man, and then they go to Zonal. No, nope, do not let him get it. Who's gonna get that? He still has that ball. It's Vasquez. Good, 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 good. Easy. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. Come on with your speed, He's bro. Your away. speed. Where's your speed, bro? Rashford. He's got the ball glued to his feet. It's one. Oh, that was amazing. Vasquez. Yeah, it's fine. The game's not broken. And here's Rashford. He's a little chipping. Oh, we're trying to go for a banger. It's a YouTube video. Come on, we're trying to go for a banger. We gotta hit a banger. Come on. I hit one my last game. I played a game before this. I hit one my last game. This is Coutinho. Still about this game because he's really tired. I don't know why they get so tired so quickly. That's kind of annoying. He got tired at like the 60 minute mark. Come on, bro. In a real game to do that, they won't have no contract no more. Played into space out wide. Damn, that's so annoying. Excellent challenge. Vasquez. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept. So no I don't know if that was power. Behind. Yeah, he's sad because yeah, winning. pretty obvious this three zero. was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag. And he was never going to last until oh, the final good. whistle. Nice, nice. Ricardo Rodriguez. I only do good when I don't talk, but I have to talk because it's YouTube video. He could well do without. Shut it down! Oh, extraordinary. Yeah, I was rushing my goalkeeper and thank God I did because that was a good idea. Send him. Trippier. Juan Mata. Mata. And here's Rashford. Coleman. Over to the left. In with a header. Yeah, a little bit clean. I was going for that player, but it's kind of hard to aim for a uh, high balls. Oh, yeah, lob passes, whatever you want to call it. Lob balls. Vasquez. There will be four extra minutes. Four extra minutes, of course. And it's Munir. That would have been really good. One matter. And 
now they can launch a counter. Let's do it, let's do it. Oh, that was nice. You gotta score one now. Oh, no. Do it again? Nah. <gasps> no way. They did it again, though. I mean, I'll take it. Why the fuck not? Two rainbows over two players? No banger after the rainbows, but it's all good. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Barcelona simply imposed their strength from start to finish, and this became as predictable as predicted. Anybody leveled up? Nah, of course, of course. A bunch of money. Probably gonna have to use that money right now for uh, Trippier. Which is the guy I have to renew his contract for. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, and Coleman. Fuck. Alright, yeah. I have enough money to use that, so I can. Dope. Damn, I already suck at Pez, huh? All right. Anyways, uh, this is going to mark the end of the video. Uh, tell me what I could have done better. Tell me if you guys like the commentary. Tell me if I missed anything. And uh, especially, please, please, please sub and like. Uh, it really helps me out. And uh, just, you know, just you know, be there for me. Support me. And uh, if you guys want to see more of this and more Pez, just, you know, just comments, bro. Comment, comment. I need, I'll read all your comments. I'll like all your comments. Do everything, all right?